Hey guys, and welcome to another Factorio workshop. As always, I'm here with Mad Zuri. Greetings. And today we are going over uh, something a little bit different. This is submitted by El Strages. Uh, he's done one or two things that we've covered previously. And uh, this is a nice little base starter kit blueprint book he's uh, given us here. It has a nice little sign <laughs> notifies he made it. But uh, yeah, it includes... Um, some turret and ammo production to make everything and red and green science which is pretty much about everything you would need for your early game setups and uh, I'll let Zuri I'll let you take over here and just kind of you know generally go over stuff but overall it's uh, it's really well done yeah it's, it is really well done you'll notice that a lot of these aren't like build ratios but if you think about it, early game, it's really silly to try to make assembly machine twos at 100%. That's yeah, absurd. The number of gear factories you need and the number of iron belts it'll eat. Mm -hmm. So yeah, early game stuff like this, and you build everything, even mid to late game, it's fine. Just a, uh, you know, slowly but surely build up what you need. Right. You even got pipes, which is what everyone tends to forget to build for some reason. And <laughs> they're very much needed. Like, you'll you'll wish you had a pipe build before you start your oil builds. Trust me. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's painful otherwise. Also, I recommend changing the limit on the steam engine chest, because one stack probably isn't going to do ya. Yeah, yeah, that's the one thing. Um, all these other boxes are limited, and they seem to be limited to, uh, you know, reasonable, good quantities. Usually just one stack, but yeah, for the steam engines, you're probably going to want more than just ten uh, stored up. Yeah, you can always change the stacks later to what you want. Mm -hmm. Even includes a small pole build, which I rarely see automated. Yeah, but it's surprising how, how many you go through, and I mean, you know, sometimes it can take you a little while to get to those medium poles, so this is really nice. Yep, and for things like Red Science, he's overproducing gears a little bit, but again, that's fine. Mm-hmm. That's usually what I do anyway. I only build five reds and six greens and overbuild the gears locally, so I don't have to bust gears around. Yeah, for sure. Same thing with the belts and inserters. Usually I save up some belts here, but he's got them in the build everything factory, so that's fine too. Yeah, and uh, this is all good, correct ratios. Um, you know, the circuit thing, it doesn't even have to work all the time anyway for this. And it, it's good, it's it's nice. And, you know, right ratios in the turret thing, kind of same things to make everything right, is it doesn't run 100%, uh, but it doesn't need to and it would be extremely difficult early game to actually get it to run 100% since it takes a whole lot of iron and gears to do that so yeah i've seen people try to make them work 100% early game and it's it's painful oh yeah yeah it's it's definitely a bit of a pain and he has a nice uh, ammo here he's limited to two stacks i think that's a pretty reasonable amount you definitely do want to cap these boxes Yeah, and then switch over to piercing rounds as soon as you get them. Yeah, and that would actually, with your copper, uh, well, you would, it'd be pretty easy to switch, right? Your copper's already here, you could throw in some steel, or just do a whole different build, but... But yeah. Yeah, I'm thinking a different build would be better. Mm-hmm. Just don't forget to turn off the old one. <laughs> yeah, that could be bad. But, uh... Yeah. yeah. This looks just about filled up, and there's even an uh, inserter here you can rotate to store green circuits if you need it, I noticed. Oh, that's really nice, because even with this, sometimes you need circuits to make random stuff in your pocket. So this is a really nice thing. Let me just cap that, too. Yep, so, perfect is really good. Very nice. Yeah. Uh, well done, and you know, if uh, if you're someone who struggles with, with some early game builds or just wants something straight up and easy, um, obviously the blueprint strings will be in the description. Good builds to use for sure. Um, easy and well done. But uh, but that really covers it. I mean, that's all there is here. But it's uh, 
it's kind of nice something different we haven't really done many early game builds and a, a nice little starter pack like this is quite nice indeed Alrighty, well, I think that'll do it, guys. As always, love to hear your thoughts down in the comments and any other submissions as well. But uh, until next time, we will catch you later. Later.